This is my 2003 Ford F-150 Lightning in sonic blue with 122,000 miles. Look at it. Would you look at it? Oh, uh, would you look at that? Put that Just on. look at that. All right, this may have been an impulse buy. I saw it for sale. It was at a dealer. It was a one owner. The guy traded it in and got himself a brand new uh, F-150, some, you know, um, I think Black Ops edition or something. And, you know, he when he traded it in, he said, I want the next owner to get this extra set of wheels and extra headlight, the uh, factory um, rear end because he changed the, the, the gearing, the, um, man, I don't even, oh, the, the factory window sticker. Look at this, look at this. This, this previous owner, this gentleman, he held on to this. Look at this, this thing is beautiful. Look at that. Look at the price of, of this truck back in the day. But yeah, that's pretty cool. And he literally told, you know, the dealership when he traded it in, he said, I want the next owner to get all this stuff because that stuff that he had kept, you know, he had saved and he took really good care of it. I mean, there's minimal tear on the seats. Usually when you see these for sale, the seats are really torn up. You know, here it's it's getting there, you know, it's, it's, it's kind of weird, maybe it's all lifted, but you know, it's intact, it's not ripped. And the interior is super clean, well taken care of. All the panels are good, they're intact. There's no cracks on the dash, but you know, it's, it's, it's great to see that this was really taken care of. Look at it. And the door jam. And yeah, let's look at the inside. You got the, uh, the pin pad here to get in, which is nice. One thing I also noticed, I don't think the regular F-150s have this, is the turn signal on here, on the, on the front side of it, which is kind of cool. And driver's side, same thing. The seat's not, you know, there's wear to it, but it's not ripped like most lightnings that you see. I think the worst part of this is right there. But besides that, the seat's in good shape. Steering wheel is going to be worn. But that's expected with any car with this mileage. Let's get on in. You got the reverse glow gauges. Man, I remember that was that was the thing to have, you know, or to change on your car was get the reverse glow gauges. And you can see right here, 122. Does have an aftermarket radio. He did include the factory radio. And it's a, you know, it's a pretty basic radio. Check it out. Everything's in really good shape. You can see all the perforated. And the door panel is still good. Man, I love this thing. I'm really happy with this purchase. This obviously goes up and then comes back down. You got your storage in here. Got this engine bay, pretty clean, pretty taken care of, pretty quiet. You might hear, you know, I, I mean, I hear injectors. I don't know how the camera will pick it up, but it's, you know, it's not ticking. It's, I hear injectors, you know, everything's pretty quiet, pulleys. This is kind of dirty, and I did suspect it of uh, maybe having a blown head gasket because that's obviously a given with these trucks. But when I took it on test drive, I did give it, I did, I did give it some leaf blows, and uh, you know I didn't see any cooling coming out. And usually, when it builds boost, is when it starts leaking from there. So I think we're okay. Hopefully. Now, this thing already broke. I've had it for a few weeks. It already broke twice, and those videos will come up next, but th nothing major, very simple stuff. But yeah, clean engine bay, and yeah. I'm really, really happy with this purchase. I honestly couldn't be happier. And it was an impulse buy. Bed's a little, it was used. 
you could say it was used. You know, it looks like they were cut it with a grinder here. It's got this rubber mat underneath. It's not too bad. It's dented, you know, there's scratches. It was used as a truck. This is, for me, it's gonna be kind of like a work truck. You know, trips to the Home Depot and whatnot. Like I said, it did break already on me twice. So you can expect to see those videos coming up. And let me know what you guys think. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And let me know if you wanna see some more lightning content.